are unhappy about is some of the malpractices that we see and I'll give you a couple of illustrations. So should you expect some measures from SEBI uh, to come in that direction? I think the answer is yes because we now have the data so we will now act. So for instance, mule accounts, we all know how those work, right? Uh, we are now getting evidence and data about it, so we have to come and do something about it. The second is in terms of inflating the IPO application numbers to give an impression of high amount of subscription. So either people who are, um, you know, who later withdraw their applications or even worse now, okay, because I think we fixed that problem of withdrawal, so now they've moved to uh, you apply in a manner that your application gets rejected. So you put in hundreds and hundreds of crores of applications with multiple pans, knowing full well that they will get rejected. So the whole purpose of applying is to inflate the number, knowing full well that it will get rejected. Right? So these are the kind of practices which we are observing because we now have the data to be able to see such practices. And we are also seeing, I would say, that there is some pattern of which kind of merchant bankers uh, tend to be, uh, let us say, more frequent names occurring in such kind of malpractices. And therefore, we will be, uh, for the, in the interest of the investors, we will be required to both review policy as well as enforcement action on such areas. 